Hello, Miami-Dade County. Two years ago today, I had the extraordinary honor to be installed as your first woman mayor, shattering our county's highest and hardest glass ceiling. I am so proud of all that we've accomplished together. We faced great challenges together as a community, and we've seen enormous progress in growing our economy and making Miami-Dade safer for all our residents. Since my first day in office, we've been working for you. Together, we navigated a global pandemic and set up policies that have helped us become the most recovered economy in the country. Our unemployment rate is at an all-time low. Our small businesses are thriving again, and we have one of the lowest crime rates in the country. We are also tackling our affordability and housing crisis that is pricing families out of their homes. And that is why I declared a countywide affordability crisis earlier this year and rolled out our Building Blocks program to help bring you relief. We passed the Tenants' Bill of Rights, expanded the Emergency Rental Assistance Program, created the Office of Housing Advocacy, put together the Building Blocks Fund that will help to expand our affordable housing supply, and yes, we prevented over 30,000 evictions for our working families. We're taking on other big challenges too. This month alone, we've made two major commitments to expand our public transit system by accelerating progress on the North Corridor and announcing plans to expand Metro Mover to Miami Beach, the community preferred one seat option. I am proud to work alongside Interim Commission Chair Oliver Gilbert, Commissioner Eileen Higgins, and all the members of the Board of County Commissioners on these critical community initiatives. We're working with the public and private sectors to tackle the climate crisis, and we have launched innovative programs like Operation Community Shield and Peace and Prosperity to reduce violence and increase safety in our community. I know these are the issues that matter to you. And my administration is focused on getting the job done. Still, for all this progress, I know there's more work to do. As we look to the year ahead, my team and I are ready to take our local economy to the next level, getting wages up, creating better paying jobs, protecting our water and our environment in the face of climate change, further boosting our small businesses, startups, and so much more. So let me be clear, we are ready and optimistic about all that is to come in year three. Miami-Dade, I mean it when I say that our best days are ahead of us, not behind us, and it's with purpose and resolve that I ask you to join me in looking ahead. Because as I've said from the very beginning, Together, we will win the future. Thank you, Miami-Dade.